Like show me and get buried. No, like Gloria Gaynor, I will survive. <laughs> Why do I'm focused? Today's trending topic Ooh, is <laughs> the Kelly Clarkson effect. We need like a sound effect like the Kelly Clarkson. Effect. I know, right? No, I mean it's just a joke about how whenever she covers anyone's songs, like it's you're cooked. Yeah, you're cooked. You're basically. cooked. You better hope and pray that Kelly Clarkson does not find your song. I know you think you've made it big, but you really haven't. Mm -hmm. made it. I feel like covers are a way for people to like interact with their audience and like show their audience like whatever. Whereas like pre-internet, it's like you would only sing if you were doing like a performance per se. So like, you wouldn't want to yeah, waste like, it on at a cover. A concert, you would try and like break up having just yeah. your song, so you'd sing someone else. So you pick there. and choose like important ones. Whereas like now, it's like any b make a TikTok covering. Whatever. Yeah, or like even all the games of like song association and yeah. like just people singing other people's songs. Yeah. Which I get the appeal of, but it's just so funny because I remember Prince was doing, he's said it multiple times, but he was not a fan of sampling and he was not a fan of covering. He just thought it was the most unoriginal Lazy. thing <laughs> someone could do. And I'm like, you know, I kind of <sighs> ate with that thought though. It was like very tribute esque and like, I remember he was talking about Beyonce and he was like, oh yeah, like, I respect her because she knows music. Mm -hmm. Whereas some other people, I think it comes off as like, this is a popular song that sounds cool, so here. Or yeah. half the time it's just a producer producing a song, but the mm -hmm. singer actually doesn't know where the original comes from. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Do it. Okay, and I'm just saying, please don't come for me, but I'm just saying, in those cases, then you get people like Kwasa from Mama Moo covering Irreplaceable and like throwing in the N word for fun. For no good reason. <laughs> there's no N word in that song and there's no reason for the N word to be in that song. Okay? And she just threw it in there like a. Like the radio <laughs> version was the most famous and I don't think she was hearing it. Like. Yeah, so that's what happens when you just cover songs that you're like. Like, I don't even know where she heard that version of the song that she was covering. Yeah, like Beyonce performed it like that once. Or yeah, or maybe or she watched like. a cover of it and did a cover of the cover. Like, I don't know where she got that from, but. And she's not the only one, so we're not yeah, the, I she's like not the only one. Yeah, the thing of like you didn't take the time to actually learn. Mm -hmm. And here's the thing, like, Kelly Clarkson's works because it's her show. Mm. Like, she, no one's forcing her to yeah. do it. It's not like she's, yeah. like, not making her own music. It's like, no, she just wants to sing. And, like, yeah. instead of having a band or something, she's like, okay, I can be the band, bitch. I can sing. Like, I don't need to outsource for this. <laughs> I can do it myself. Yeah. Um, And I think there's also times where sometimes there's artists where... A song just suits them so good that mm. you just want to hear them sing it. Like when Miley was really deep in her rock era phase. Yes! And she oh was doing God. like Heart of Glass. Yes! Um, the yes. Arctic Monkey Snaps, song. bitch! I love those performances. Those performances eat down! Yeah. <laughs> Which also like Miley, the shapeshifter, like rock, yeah. country, pop, bitch. Oh! The song really fits into the thing. Sure. And not mm. to like bring it up and justify, but even like. Granted, Dolly Parton wanted Beyonce to do it. I think it's also different when the singer wants you to do it. Mm. Putting Jolene on her Cowboy Carter album. I'm like, yeah. The girls? Oh, my God. The amount of people that I hear come up to me and say, like, I don't like Jolene. Like, I don't like what she did with Jolene. The girls that get it, get it. And the girls that don't, don't. So shut up if you're one of the girls that don't. Please. As if they were diehard Jolene fans in the beginning. <laughs> yeah. That's what kills me. I'm like, are Goodbye. you Dolly Stan? <laughs> they're like, they're like the original fandom that I don't know about? <laughs> Yeah, literally. <laughs> I'm like, what are you so... It's very anti-woman. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Shut like, up. if a girl was coming at your man, you wouldn't say some shit. Like, like, if anyone was coming for your man, like... People that are like, girl, no one wants Jay-Z. No one wants a billionaire. I know your fugly ass would marry a billionaire if he took care of you, okay? <laughs> no one's... People aren't... That's what Beyonce said. Didn't she, didn't she say... It must be... What did she say? must be the cash because it ain't your face. <laughs> Beyonce said that shit, okay? It must be the cash because it ain't your face. Like, she knows, okay? But she also knows people go... He's That's got the thing that girls go after. Like, shut up that if you had a chance with a person of Jay-Z's status that you would not go after them. Shut the fuck up. Yeah, but shut it's also up. like, Jay-Z's with Beyonce. You think he wants you? You? He don't want me. I can tell you that the right silence now. silence is loud, babe. Us in our room. <laughs> 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 no, 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 that was a side.
sidetrack though. That was a sidetrack because it, if the cover me, oh my god, this lipstick. I'm literally eating hair. That's fucking disgusting. Disgusting. Shit. Disgusting. Shit. Um, if the if the cover makes sense and you can serve it either equal value or better than the original, you are in the clear. Yeah. But you cannot do a cover of a song that you know you cannot hit. Like, a prime example of this, Hallie Angel, she made that song, she said no one's gonna be able to cover oh, this. Oh, yeah. It's not a single person. Try. And if you can't, just don't. Yeah. Like, it's, it's you're better but off not doing it. on the flip side, I feel like there's so many examples that I can't even name one right now. Or mm -hmm. not that I can't name one, I won't, because fandoms. <laughs> um, but I find K-pop covers to be very lackluster. So sometimes they eat. Yeah, sometimes they serve cunt, like Perfect Man BTS. Oh my god, I love that performance. Momo pole dancing to move. Oh, goodbye! The oh taste god. and even picking moves. Yeah, good. Girl. And other times I'm like, please leave this song alone. Because <laughs> it's too good of a song. Like, <laughs> I can't. And it like it makes the person covering it like make it, it makes the idol look worse. Uh, Cause it's like by comparison. What's the Lisa one? She did such a good cover dance cover of a song one time. Was it dance cover? She oh oh you know what? I was thinking of the one she did on tour, but now that I'm even remembering, remember that? I don't know the name of the song. I'll put it here because it's so iconic. Yeah, she ate that oh, yeah. down. That was swallowed. She <laughs> Yeah. But again, like she And she did not talk to such a big artist that you would assume like, oh, she has access to her own choreographer, yeah. this and that. But it's like, no, I'm gonna take someone else's song and just dance to it. Cunt, especially for if that's your and she thing. She did that amazing. If that's your thing, like Lisa's a dancer, bitch. Yeah. And she said, I'm gonna prove it. I'm gonna keep proving it. I just it. hate the lazy covers. Yes. You know what I mean? Like, like Lisa, she had a whole like video to it. Like it was cunt as fuck. I really don't love the I'm just gonna sit down here and sing this song. <laughs> Super Unless it's leisurely. like 2013 and you're Ariana Grande sitting on the floor of whatever on a laptop. That's like different. that's homegrown <laughs> type of shit. <laughs> yeah. And also, once again, you can do that if you have skill. Yes, but if you have the budget to make something, you know, actually good, like, use it. I mean, even when she did her emotions cover, it yeah. was like an at-home thing, but it was still really it well was, edited. It was super so cute. good. It was yeah. so cute. Is there anyone that you would love to see cover something? <sighs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like any B oh my god, this is so basic, bitch. But um I feel like any BTS member, I would love to see them do covers because they're my faves. So any rap covers that BTS want to do, which BTS sample quite a bit, which is always fun. Um, but in terms of singers, oh, Jimin covering a Sam Smith song, I feel like really? would be beautiful. Yes, 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 yes. The vision, <laughs> the vision is there. That's an interesting pick. It I was so random. It was to. so random. But I, I almost thought you were going to go classic and be like Jimin doing like a dance cover to an Usher song or something. Oh, yeah. Dance cover, I feel like, would also Any be from Jimin. Cover, but, yeah. but actually, it's funny you say that because I think Jimin does the best um, dancing when he's doing contemporary. He is fucking a little fairy just darting around the stage. Beautiful contemporary dancing. Like, obviously, he eats with hip-hop, whatever. But it's a different level when Jimin pulls out his, like, little like beautiful you know what i mean and he's like so graceful and he's just like skipping around the state oh you know i know jungkook loves his pop music and his pop covers which he sounds great on but i would love to hear him saying like something more r&b but like more stripped back yes. and kind of more register yes yes i was like even if it was like a woman's song or something, I feel like he would. I feel like his voice suits that style, but mm. he never really explores it because mm. he likes pop music, mm. obviously. But guys, still with you, one of his best songs. Yes, still. still. Yes, I was listening to that today. No, still with you stays on top, and standing next to you, mm -hmm. I find his best song Ooh. for me. Ooh. Tell us yours. <laughs> I can't believe the guy was like, oh, I wasn't even sure I liked it. Like, <laughs> girl, bye. Um, I'm so happy whoever pushed him to do it pushed him. We should put in, like, an AI version of them singing. <laughs> <laughs> if we can do that, we'll insert it here. But I'm if not, not I'm anti-AI sure voice. I hate <laughs> those videos. 
No, but that's why I'm saying how cheap it is. Like, <laughs> you, these singers don't even have to sing the songs, and there's a cover of them singing someone else's song. Like, oh, I would love to hear Ariana Grande sing. Shut the fuck up. Like, shut up. I can't with the AI covers. They well, really kill me. Listen, if we can't find them, I'm sure they're on TikTok. I'm sure you could find any song covered yeah. by an AI on TikTok. But anyways, um, yeah, let us know in the comments what you guys think about. First of all, give us who you would want to see do a cover of which song. And also, what do you guys think about covers in general? Do you think they're, like, cheap? Do you like seeing them? Is any content from your fave good content? We also have a poll going up. We're going to list some celebrity covers that we fucking love. And you can vote on which one's your fave. And, yeah, if you enjoyed the video, please make sure to subscribe. And we'll see you in the next one. Bye!